playing some arena solo. Oh yeah, about that. I've been streaming because I have um, been on a cruise. Hallelujah. section below. I don't know. I do we maybe? I don't know. Oh yeah, I wanna watch a World Cup match. Cat me we're doing like a duo. I'm not joking. No, I wash my hands. I have to get the perfect group on my mouse so I I wash my hands. Um, I'm wearing this combo, I don't know why I just like it. I have a warm-up game today. So I just tell people to stick and like one sensitivity and just work your way at it. And it really comes along with my aim, my building. Subscribe. I want to meet some of you guys who subscribe to the channel. Keep in now. This is my very my maybe favorite this, but I don't want to really get in. This is my favorite pickaxe in the game. I just love it. Did you know you can open a company for $75? I never knew that. Every 
everyone who is on this board has the ability to challenge for the top spot to be the first ever duos world champion at the Fortnite World Cup. No one is out of it. The Chinese bear is just off the page as well. Anybody can make a play. Two matches are left. Let's head back inside, back into the action. Lupo and Courage, take it away. Sundown, thank you so much for analysis the board thus far. And you're right. Yeah, it's quite a sick team. I know I got a little It is life changing, out of money to say the least. As you know, people talking around millions and millions to be today. Use the hashtag Fortnite World Cup. I want to hear from you right now. Sweet Dr. Lupo, myself. Fortnite, which region will come out on top? Will NA remain up top? Will EU stop back to her? Some of the Asian Oceania and Brazil region still trying to push on through. I think, I think NA is going to do it. I NA really do. It's anybody's game to be one of us, but it's, it's interesting to see trends from the qualifiers from the previous weeks. You know, those attacks leading up to this moment. So Stars then, stars I'm getting up here, and consistency is going through. You know, big, I'm big kidding. ways we go into late games. We've had some of the highest player count in the final circles that we've ever seen. Ever. We've had a lot of aggressive gameplay from people in clutch moments. And that's not the end, Jack. We've got two games left, and game five is ready to go, Jack. Ladies and gentlemen, this crowd has been incredible live in the arc crash. Arena in New York City. Which region will reign supreme? Five, four, three, two, one. The battle bus has launched. Game five is underway. Yeah. The last few matches, Jack, we've seen some relatively contested. Popular drop zones. I've been watching on Twitter, and a lot of people have discussed whether or not Loot Lake right now is one of the hottest drops in the game. You have a number of duos, high power duos that have dropped there consistently thus far. Do you think going into this game five and six, we're gonna we're gonna see similarly contested early drops, or are people gonna change up the strategy? Guys, how do you switch like that? I want to get to my trap. Ow, I don't. You know, staying out on top. That's why they're consistently placing to take that. Would it be surprised if you um, stick to normal okay. game one more time? Again, as Sundown did a great job of doing that, Dr. Lupo. One big performance, 12 limbs and a victory royale, 22 point game, which is way up the leaderboard. So you can't count yourself out yet. Let's see our last match. Contested there, am I right? I don't have any good loot. Like, bro, could you give me good loot? Like, Hmm. Tell me if we should hit up some weird duos with someone. I'm I'm gonna try to like uh, play with a bot who's on like Division One and just get free kills. That would be cool. So you can hear me, but like my mic is broken. Okay, so don't get mad at me. Just don't. Just don't. Okay. Lesson. You don't want to L the camera necessarily too early. Yep. Love to see the confidence, so he's a very confident player, which does not surprise me. Extremely skilled, so that kind of gameplay, you're going to see it from Skeptic on and off the stream and on and off the land here. Arthur Ashe Stadium, one of the coolest streams I think we've ever done this in. Oh, it's incredible. It's, uh, you walk out there, you see all the tennis greats. You know, I hope they put up a poster of the winner of the Fortnite World Cup. There's Serena Williams, Zach and Zay. Honestly, it would be incredible. It would be, I think, I mean, I think that sounds good to me. I think that, you know, people wouldn't be confused at all. 
Why? Look at the same boxes. I don't want to go play them. I'll go buy them. I'll probably go to the private box. Viking bomb, I don't know if I can only see the guy. He has four shadow bombs this early in the game. Those are incredibly powerful going into late game, especially when you're attempting to avoid. What are villain visions here? Shadow bomb out of almost anything. Which honestly is typically typically the click the case in a lot of this. Definitely. At this point, yeah, it looks like they're just opting to do a little bit of a split here. Just watching the opponents move around down below. They don't necessarily have to push it yet. They do have a little bit of time. Keep the combat, Jesus. Are you serious? Like. Ugh. <sighs> She just did a good job.
it up through and peek. So they immediately call that out. They time the shot alongside AR shots. And that one, I think, is actually a shotgun. And Zach is going to be peeking up the wall. As right now, it's Zayt all by himself. Now moving towards the end of the map here. Flash plan. Next friend, no longer there, but Nyx just took a ton of damage. Close by, I believe. Did he get sniped? I think he got sniped. and late game rotations are capitalized by players that have the high ground advantage. But even early game, high ground gives you a bit of a okay. Sean, Sean goes down, Aiden, and then trying to push on through and try and pick up the elimination. Because like the sound from the World Cup that I'm watching right now. I think it's my real game, you know. Yeah, the I was going to say, I think that the yeah, game was Before I started training earlier today, I had all like eight kills and I'm like, yay, yeah, and I'm like, why? And I had eight kills and I'm like, why, why, why? So when I started streaming, I turned on bot mode, you know? I wanna one do one with you guys. I wanna see how bad that was. Mm-hmm. 
them. What? What did you do? Like 10 more minutes. Okay. Okay. Tell me when 10 minutes is up. Okay. Why the time up in the corner right there? Okay, we're shocking this guy. He was at five health. Guys, I can't do this. I can probably play longer. He didn't have like full shield for that nice haunt. Like, if I would have gone for a shield right there, I would have killed him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tell me if I can change my skin. Should I start doing like, um, like, uh, sponsors on my Glatton uh, YouTube channel? No, no. Shot comes on in, does get a small attack. Not too much to get to push that. Good job at least getting up to 
layer of height. It's so tough with elevation. Still, bottom right of your screen, another solo still remaining. It's Zane, who still has the lead. Many shadow bombs left, Dr. Lupo, to make plays in the late game. How did he come? Yeah, guys, I think that's going to be it for a See you guys next time.